Hey everyone, uh, today's St. Patrick's Day, and as a musician, and as a percussionist, and as actually an Irish citizen, little known fact, not a lot of people know that, it's true. Anyway, uh, I have found this instrument to be one of my favorite ways to make music. It's uh, an Irish frame drum, it's called a bowron. It's spelled B-O-D-H-R-A-N which is the Celtic uh, way of spelling it um, in the Celtic language, Irish, um, but it's pronounced Bowron. Basically, it's a simple thing. It's just a, a tube made of wood um, and then an animal skin, which is a traditional way that we used to cover drums. Uh, this one is actually a goat skin um, that was taken and stretched across this thing and treated in certain ways. Um, for it to have a head on one side and then open on the back. And it's open in the back because I actually use my hand to put pressure against the inside of it and change the pitch of it and actually make it more than just a drum sound. Um, and then I have here literally just a bundle of little thin wooden sticks that I use, I hold in my hand and I make the drum make a sound. So if I were to display it without touching it, kind of a deep sound. When I start to use my hand on the back side, that's when I can give it some different sounds. So I thought I'd play along with uh, just a recording of, of a very well-known, one of the more well-known Irish jigs. Um, it's called the Kesh Jig, and this is by a group called the Bothy Band. You'll hear a lot of traditional Irish music instruments, Ilian pipes, which are kind of like a smaller version of bagpipes. Um, and you'll hear some guitar, lots of times you'll hear whistle or, or fiddle, which is just a violin that they call a fiddle. Um, and typically other Irish traditional instruments would be singing and the sound of people dancing because it's music to be danced to. So here's how I would just kind of play a jig on the bow run. So I just want to give you a little bit of a, what I'm doing to keep making music at home. I hope you're finding ways to keep doing that as well, and I'll uh, see you soon.